Six months ago, when the Austin F1 racetrack project was on the ropes, a local small business owner threatened to sue project promoters. Now, with the F1 project back on track, that threat is a distant memory. And new at 6 tonight, KXAN's Jim Swift tells us the business owner may be riding the F1 deal to a checkered flag victory of his own. Warren Peck's Races to You business began as a trailer operation in which he took a mobile slot car racetrack to birthday parties and such. And Peck was counting on the new Austin F1 track to give his business a big boost. Formula One, of course, is one of the most followed sports in the world. It's one of my keywords. People find my website because they're looking for Formula One. Um, so, you know, anything that's, that's good for Formula One is good for me. So, when the Austin F1 project appeared to be crashing into the wall last November, Peck was perturbed. My business will suffer, and a lot of my friends and colleagues' businesses are going to suffer. So, Peck took the lead in threatening promoters with a class action lawsuit. Circuit of the Americas and Formula One and the city of Austin had all presented Formula One coming as fact, as a done deal. So it was almost like false advertising when they said, oh, we're not going to do it. Now, with construction of the Austin track racing toward completion, in time for the 2012 Formula One United States Grand Prix in November. Ready, set, go. Peck has added to his slot car trailer operation an actual brick and mortar business in North Austin, complete with an approximate replica of the real thing. If my threatening a lawsuit was part of the impetus to, to get it done, then uh, I don't know that it was. I can't take credit for it because I really don't know what went on behind those doors. But if it was, I'm, I'm happy to, you know, I'm happy that I did it. Three, two, one. But what Peck is most happy about is the chance to mine the nostalgia of his youth and wrap it around the children of today. Kids who might otherwise be glued to a video game of some sort. This is a nice alternative. This is a lot more social than video games. I and mean, here you can have, you know, four, five, six kids racing each other at a time. You get that competitiveness going on, the trash talking, and, you know, it, it's a lot more fun. Fun for the kids, and fun for the kids still kicking. And the rest of us. <laughs> that was bad. Jim Swift, oh. KXAN News.